We said we wanted to get married But we were only ten so we had to wait Lovers been a stolen kiss And holding hands with nobody else around That's just me and Charlie talking La 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 mm, That's just me and Charlie Me and Charlie talking Hey lovelies! Hey lovelies! Hey lovelies! A $25 vegan here. It is day 7 of a 30 day $25 challenge just went to Taco Bell and I just want to tell you guys that you can eat vegan or vegetarian at a fast food place if you need to. Obviously you shouldn't eat it every day because it's still processed and it's not good for you, but if you are in the mood and you're hungry and you're out and about, that's a good option. I got a sweet, sweet potato, potato taco with no cheese and a bean burrito with no cheese. And they have lots of different, um, uh, they have lots of different um, combinations and things you can do and get that are veganized or vegetarian. You can look at the PETA website. It'll help you decide on that. So anyway, that's what I had for breakfast. I had that around 11 or 12 because we went to the library and we went and had coffee and things, and which is kind of bad. I should eat first. But anyway, so I had that. And then for lunch, I had Wine some with brown and wild rice with sriracha on top and chickpea salad on the side. Yum, yum. It was pretty darn delicious, guys. I had rice and chickpea salad for lunch and it was pretty good. It was really, really good. And that's what I've had for dinner. And I also had a, ba a mini bag of kettle corn. That's like a 100 calorie bag. Because I was feeling the binge eating coming on. And I think I'm trying to do this new thing where I drink water when I want to binge eat. Or I drink or I eat something that's high in volume but low in calories that's not completely horrible for you. That way that I eat that and my mouth is like constantly being moved so it doesn't want to eat something else. Instead of eating bread because that's been my like really bad thing lately. I've been wanting to constantly eat like loaves of bread. Just I've just been really bad at binge eating lately. It's just, it's horrifying, really. And I've been really trying to get a handle on it. So I've been trying to do things like that. People have, you should look him up on YouTube because he teaches you how to save money and become a millionaire once you're a lot older. I know it sounds like a scam, but it really isn't. Basically, you save all your money and only pay for things and cash that you really need, like your rent and such things, and the rest goes into savings. And trust me, it adds up really, really quickly. And um, basically, if you put it in a certain um, account, that it acquires um, interest so you get more money. Yep, I still read young adult books. I won't change for anyone. You don't like it, don't talk to me. Oh, well. Ooh, that was pretty much all for today, folks. Yep, I was. Yep, I was. I had some interesting things go on with family members because my nephew was having some issues and had to go to the hospital, so I watched my other nephew. Thankfully, he's okay. And, um, yeah. I didn't... I did not exercise today, but I plan on doing so tomorrow. And so... F Yeah. And if you're wondering, I didn't spend any money because my sister bought it for me. Yes, I know. I'm special because people buy things for me. I need help. Lots of help. I can't stop staring at myself. And also, I was whining a lot today because of the simple fact that I just... My hair, not my hair, my face has been really oily lately and very, very pimply. And I'm thinking, and I posted it on Facebook and people said that they think it's because 
of me having too much oils in my foods and honestly I think it's true because lately like I said I've been binge eating on bread and I'll eat it with butter on it which is like obviously vegan butter but it's pretty bad for you you know I mean once in a while not a big deal but oh that's my birthmark and it's not a big deal but you can see like all the pimples I'm breaking out so bad guys so if you know of any brands that I can buy online or anything that are cruelty free and don't have animals in them please comment below so i can get rid of this crap i think i'm gonna cut out some butter and stuff and see if that helps i don't know i have an addiction so yeah see you guys tomorrow for day eight okay i'm just being weird now my friend fed fred paper didn't make it today but you know you know you know you know susie Curtin did her name's Susie Curtin. Okay, now I'm just being weird and staring at myself. Goodbye! Okay,